Hello, it's Deborah from The Attic and today I've got another little kit to share with you. This time it's something different. These are stackable elements that you can add to your journals or cards or projects. And I'm going to show you the sheets that I've created and then I'm going to show you how to use them. So each of these little background boxes are one and a half by three inches and they are in a variety of colourways but they will all work together and I'll show you how. And then we have these ones which are a little bit more vintage and they're backed with things like newsprint and music paper, note paper, dictionary paper and other vintage style uh, sepia colours. This sheet has got 64 different words on it and each box measures one and a half by half an inch and you can use these individually or you can use them collectively in a collage. This sheet is designed to give you some colour options and some ways to pull everything together. So you don't have to worry about the colour palette. I've done all of that for you. So all of these uh, colours all work together and there are six of these rectangles with corners cut. There are four of these little phrases. So these are words that are copied from the earlier sheet but they're put onto a different colour of background and then I've added a little bit underneath them. So for example, life is good share the memories. This uh, section has got numbers in it and again they're in different sizes and colours and they will all match with these boxes at the top. And then finally we have got faux stamps. So I've created these faux stamps and I've deliberately not put scalloped edges around them because I always, I love scalloped edges on stamps but when I come to cut them out I kind of, I lose them so I either don't cut correctly around them or I feel that I should be cutting into the shape of the scallop and I'm never quite, I always feel a bit intimidated by a stamp that's got scalloped edges even though they look beautiful. So for these I've deliberately made these straight edges so you don't have to even worry about a scallop shape. They all match in uh, with the colours above here. Now the final sheet is the one that I hope you will find the most useful because what I've done is I've created uh, a sheet with 12 examples of how you can use all of the elements from the earlier sheets. And this is part of the kit. So if you want something quick and easy, you can simply cut these out. Now be careful when you cut them out because some of them I've made them deliberately go over the edge of the little rectangle, such as here as well. They, they pop out over the edge. So you can cut these out and you can just stick them straight into your project or you can use these for inspirational layouts and you can copy the layout but maybe change some of the elements. So for example, you might want to have a sepia label on the back here or a different stamp or a different little phrase in here. The other thing that you can do is cut out some of these elements and then stick them onto these as a background so then you'll get some 3D. That's what I'm going to show you. I cut out all of my pieces and it didn't take very long at all because they're all straight edges, it's nice and easy. And I've put both of my sheets side by side so you can pause the video, I'll move my hands out the way, and you can look at the differences. This is the printed sheet and this is a sheet where I've added 3D elements and you can see that I've added extra things like a little bit of uh, ribbon. I've also used a couple of little staples. I've changed up some of the words on the project. So for example here I've used the word created from nature instead of thankful for it all. I've also punched out some branches using a Martha Stewart branch stamp. I'm afraid there isn't, uh, or punch I should say, there isn't a name on this, but it's a Martha Stewart and I, it's just a branch. So I've done that to add a little bit of texture and interest on some of these as well. There's a little piece of lace here and I've just switched out a whole load of the effects but by looking at both of these sheets I hope that will give you a few more ideas and obviously then you would cut these out and use them on your projects. So this kit is now available in my Etsy store. I'll provide all of the links below this video. If you haven't already please subscribe, please give this video a thumbs up, it really helps me and until we meet again stay safe and take care.